Welcome to a tutorial on Joomla and XML sitemaps. And now this is especially if you are using Virtumart uh, shopping cart. If you're not using Virtumart shopping cart, then this extension, the XML extension to create a sitemap for your map should work okay, just as, as directed. Uh, but the this is a tutorial specifically if you're having problems with Virtumart, uh, which I was. So what we're going to do is go up to the uh, menu manager and we're going to actually just create a, a new menu. And if you just call your menu products and the menu type is products as well and just save and close that. Now you're going to go and uh, open a, a new item in menu items and all you're going to do is create a new item. Make sure that the, the menu location let's see is uh, products, there we go, change that to, to products. and. If you just call your menu type uh, cat list, which is short for category list, and then choose your menu item type, so we just click there, select, and the one that you want to select is Virtumark categories layout. So we'll select that, and then I'll give you the option here, and you want to go for the top level category. So that's all you need to do, just save and close that. Now you don't have to worry, this won't actually show up on your website because you're not going to be publishing the actual menu as a module, so it's it's hidden on your website. But if you now go to XMAP and if you click into the, the XMAP, you'll now have the, the option uh, to tick on menus here, it's got menus and it's got your main menu and now it's got products which is the one that you've just set up and you can change the the frequency and the and the priority and change any options that you need uh, there and that's it if you just do save and close now you can now click on the XML sitemap It's probably going to take a, a few minutes to, to load. Oh, there it is. There, S some of them have uh, have come up. But all you're needing to do is just click on the the link here, uh, and just copy that, and then you can go over into your uh, Google Webmaster Tools if you want, or wherever it is that you would normally set up your your sitemap, and just add the the sitemap in there. So let's do a, a quick check just make sure that it loads up okay and just submit that and that should be it if you like this tutorial please subscribe and like the video as well. Thanks for watching.